We are coming to you live from the Thor Motor Coach Studio headquarters and the star of the show, the 2023 Ace. Not only are we broadcasting live to all of Thor Motor Coach social media sites right now, we are broadcasting simultaneously to a number of Thor Motor Coach dealers around the globe. So wherever you are watching, however you are watching, thank you for being here. You could be doing anything with your time right now, but you are spending it with us and we appreciate it. And you're going to love the 2023 Ace. Now, the Ace has been around since 2011. Can you believe it? Fantastic motorhome. I have traveled in it on many vacations with my family. In fact, with the 4th of July coming up, about 21 million people are gonna be out on the roads camping. Number one spot, know what it is? Take a guess, put it in the comments below. State Parks. State Parks, the number one destination. You could be there in your 2023 Ace. We are gonna walk you through the entire motorhome. We have the slide in right now. We will eventually put it out, but before we do that, I wanna walk outside and show you one of the top new features for the Ace. Starting up front, the very first thing you are going to notice, look at that front cap. A one-piece fiberglass front cap. See what's missing? The brow is gone. You now have a larger windshield in place. Gives you a nice big view of wherever you are traveling as we head on down. I like this. I like the little carbon fiber look down there. That actually makes you five miles per hour faster. It does. It does. I like this too. If you travel with pets, and we have taken our dogs before, couple purposes for this window. You can call it a pet window and and your little dog right there, ours is Bentley. He likes to lay there and look out the window. This is also a trucker's window, which is great when you are sitting there at a light, you can look down. Maybe there's a motorcycle next to you. Maybe you are in a town and there's a bike lane. Great way to give you visibility of the road. And you have integrated cameras into your remote heated mirrors. Notice they are black this year. I like this, that is nice. You can adjust those inside, at least the top one down below. You go ahead, dial that in. And then when you turn your directional on, left or right, whatever is in the field of view of this camera is going to shoot straight down the side here. We put them up in the mirror, and I really like this instead of somewhere down here by the fender wells. That way, if you're going somewhere muddy, they're gonna get splashed. It's not gonna do you any good. That is the place to have them. As we work our way down, so many bays to open. We're gonna open and I'll show you what's inside. We have our batteries right there. We have our exterior TV. This is gonna be great when you are just setting up outside. Maybe you're gonna have something hooked to the exterior propane connection. We'll get there. We gotta work our way down there, but you can kick back, have a family movie night outside. Here, large storage bay. You do have a little bit of pass through up here, so maybe some fishing poles in there. I bet you can fit uh, some lawn chairs, whatever you want. Maybe a nice uh, beach umbrella, you can do that. They all have their own light. All the bays have their own light. You can control those LED light with the switch right inside. Going to open our door because a very important number we want to show you is your OCCC, your occupant cargo and carrying capacity, 1,683 pounds. This ACE is 33 feet, five inches long. It is the 32B. And when you are inside, we'll go inside in a few minutes, just kind of walk through everything here. Inside, you do have your battery disconnect switch. We showed you the batteries right. When you get ready to hit the road, go ahead, turn that on, leave it on the entire time. Fires up all the 12 volt systems in your ACE. This does have the optional solar controller, 100 watts of solar on board, which is great for a bright, sunny, 100 degree day like we are experiencing right now. And on a day like this, you don't want to add sun wrinkles, do you? No, you don't. You want to stay nice and cool. You can go ahead and you can put your awning out. Nice button here. You just hit out and away it goes. It is a 19 foot awning. Notice how it goes all the way over your campsite. The thing I like about this awning with the arms, it is so easy to adjust the pitch. So maybe there's going to be a nice light rain. Oh my. All you need to do is just take and pitch it down and that rain will run right off. You can just listen, listen to the raindrops lull you to sleep. Also inside of here, you're going to find 
the auto gen start. When we get to the other side, we will show you how to go ahead and dial it into your preferences. We'll go ahead and close this up. You do have your uh, exhaust right here, your furnace exhaust, so we'll be aware of that, that that does get hot on a day when you're camping in the cold. And yes, you can go ahead and take this in the cold. Opening up another bay for you. Look at that, another storage bay. What are you gonna put in this one? Huh? Maybe, maybe an exterior grill, whatever you want. Ooh. How about you hook up a blender? How about you, you blend up something delicious? Smoothies, adult beverage. You do have 110s out here. Those are GFCI, by the way. Oh my gosh, another storage bay. Yes, it's another storage bay. I'm telling you, this thing is full of 100 cubic feet of exterior storage on this Ace. Fresh water fill right up there. This is your exterior propane connection. You can go ahead and you can connect your own grill. You can connect a little portable fire pit. We actually have one of those little portable fire, portable fire pits at my house and it's great. It runs right off of propane and maybe the camping chairs that you see here will fit nice right in this bay. As we walk around back, ladder will take you right up top there. You do have your fuel fill. You do have an 8,000 pound hitch. You do have a seven pin and a four pin connector. And when you are deciding to tow, don't forget that you need to take that GCWR and subtract it from the GVW. Another great feature you're gonna love having. How about your own and quiet gas 4,000 watt generator? This is going to power both of your ACs, yes, two air conditioners on top of this unit. You can go ahead and fire that up when you are driving down the road on a day like today. Keep it nice and cool for your passengers inside. Right here, we do have another large storage bay. Also, your 50 amp power cord. We'll show you where that plugs in, in just a minute. Detachable, so you can store it in any bay you want. Another large bay, a little bit of pass through. We showed you the auto gen start in the doorway. Right back here is where you go ahead and dial in your runtime hours, the temperature you want it to start at. You can go ahead and set the volts. You can go ahead and set your quiet time, all that set right from in here. You know, one thing I want to point out as you're looking at this, and you're saying, okay, wait a minute, Steve, you're going through all these bays. You have yet to talk about the gorgeous new colors. Why don't we do that right now? This is our Oyster HD Max. This is called Ravishing Red. It is absolutely stunning. You can also get your ace in this color, Independence Blue. We have a color for you in the ace. As we keep moving on down here, it is our 50 amp service. Plug in your cable right here. Here we go. We do have our wet bay. We have 50 gallons of fresh water, 40 gallons of gray, and a 40 gallon black tank in here and new on the 2023 ACE. Listen, we have a macerator in here. Now, the way that this is going to work, at least the best way and what we recommend is before you use this, make sure that your black tank is about three, at least three quarters full. Before you drain it, go ahead, hold that down no more than 30 seconds. That is going to go ahead and take care of business and the black tank. Then you go ahead and you pull your black handle and then you go ahead and you can go pull your gray handle and you're draining your tanks. Now what we recommend then is you take and you hook your hose up to your Santa flush, you fill your black tank up at least halfway, you shut your handle, you go ahead and you run this again, about 30 seconds, it's gonna spray that water all around, it's gonna get things nice and clean for you. Then you can go ahead and you pull that you keep that water flowing and you're gonna have a nice clean black tank. Notice that these are all enclosed. So perfect when you wanna do a little cold weather adventuring. City water connection here. This is your six gallon hot water heater. This bay right here. What I like to carry in here, a little shop vac and I'll tell you why. If you're going to the beach and you walk back, you're gonna get sand everywhere. Pull that shop vac out sweep it out inside. And in here is also the controller for your slide wall. We'll talk a little more about that when we get inside in case there's ever an issue and the motors need to be reset. That's the bay you're going to look in on this particular ACE. Another large storage bay with a little bit of pass-through. Again, I'm telling you, the storage on this is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. And here is the propane tank that you're gonna have filled. And again, you're gonna to wanna to make sure this is on for your hot water, for your furnace, for the exterior propane connection. 
And that is a look at the outside of the 2023 Ace. I know you want to see inside, so let's walk around and take a look inside. And in, <coughs> excuse me, in we go. Well, let me get this door shut. It is cooking out there today. It is baking. Now, I do have the Ace running. The first thing I want to do is show you how much room you do have in here with the slide wall in. You can move from front. You can access your dinette. You can access your kitchen. You can access your bunks. You can access the bathroom. You can access your bed. The bed does not flip up. So if you do have to stop somewhere where you are not allowed to put your slide out, out, piece of cake to get around the ace. And that happens, right? We get involved. We go, you know, I'm going to push a little more and then you get tired and then you pull over somewhere. You don't have to put the slide out, out on this. Now, when you do, what you're going to want to do, remember, motor running, brake on, put your jacks down. We already have the jacks down. We're going to put the slides out. I'm going to walk out to your control panel here. A couple of things I want to talk about here as I put the slide out, simply hit the extend button on your slide panel is right up the top and your slide will go out. Now remember you do want your motor running, you want full power as the slide goes out. A couple other things on here, you do have your generator start. All you have to do is prime it first, hit stop till the light comes on, then hit your start button and you can fire up the generator that we just showed you. And in the event you plug in somewhere, you get uh, you get some janky juice, as I call it. You do have a fault protector on that transfer switch. Now, remember when you do take and whether you're uh, plugged into shore power or you're running your generator, all that power goes through your transfer switch and it's going to think about, okay, where am I getting my power from? And then it is going to take and distribute the power through that source. Also going through our control panel here, you do have a number of lights here. We were talking about checking the levels on your black tank. Here you go, you can check your propane tank. You can check your battery. You can check your fresh tank, your black tank, and your gray tank. This is also the switch to your water pump. You're gonna to wanna to turn your water pump on when you are boondocking. You do not need it on when you are plugged into city water. You also have your water heater here. We showed you where the propane was. Right down below, you want your propane on and then your 110 on when you're plugged into shore power. Now the propane again is going to be your primary source of heat for your hot water in here. So make sure that is on and then you can go ahead and you're plugged into shore power, turn your 110 on and that is going to maintain. Down below, we do have our thermostat, two air conditioners on this. And now that the slide is out, look, look at how open this is. Look how much room we have in here. It's beautiful in here. In fact, what we are looking at right now, this is our beautiful home collection. It has been around for a little while. It is this nice off white cabinetry. You do have the nice black hardware, but you have another option for 2023. Brand new wood, that is called Weather Cherry, and the decor is Network Grain. Here's a quick look at what everything looks like out there as we uh, start our tour. This is going to be fantastic. You're gonna love what you get in here. How about we start right over here with our dinette. All right, our dinette seats four comfortably, All right? One of my favorite features of this dinette, we've incorporated a wireless charger for your phone. Because if your family's like mine, whenever you go on vacation, you're gonna be like, oh, well, where's, where's, where's my cord? Well, I don't have my cord, do you have my cord? Do you have my cord? I haven't seen your cord, where's the cord? Doesn't matter, you got wireless charging on here. But if you do have, if you are the lucky person who has that cord, this does have USA, and USB-C ports on there. And as you look around, you're gonna notice everything is nice and clean. That is part of the Morai True Flat four Floor Foundation. This is built on seven inch steel beams on top of that F53 chassis. So what happens there is we send this off to Morai and then they build the house on those beams. It is gonna be nice and square and level. And as you look around, you notice this, the cabinets, the woodwork, everything is, is flush. So we don't have, we don't have a cord around, we don't have trim pieces, just a nice, True flat floor foundation. It's going to help you go down the road. And, and I want to point out, this is a great feature on the Ace. How about that warranty? You have a 12-year structural warranty, six-year lamination, and a one-year limited warranty. That is going to be the best in...
peace of mind when you are traveling. You are also going to find seat belts in your boot dinette. You do have a forward seat belt and a seat belt over here. And this year, uh, standard, your child safety tether. So we get to a lot of questions and a lot of people travel with their young ones, especially in the Aces. This is the family friendly coach. Well, you can go ahead and you run the uh, seat, uh, car seat down there and you can feel secure right across opposing seating, which is great when you are traveling about this sofa, All right? You got the shelf back here. You do have cups. You can put pictures of your golden retriever. Great, interesting fact about golden retrievers. They're awesome. That's, that's the fact. I have two. Bentley, who I've talked about, and uh, the newest puppy, Mr. Winston, who would love traveling in an ace. Now, the other great feature about the sofa quickly makes into a bed, right? There you go. And then in the morning, you just fold it up. And if you travel with kids who listen to their own music and they can't find their AirPod, my guess is they fell asleep with it and it went right down here in the crack. Well, that is really easy to find. You can go ahead and lift that up. And then you say, oh, you know what? There's, there's the AirPod. There are also a couple of seat belts down here. And we just have those pushed down for the sofa right now. But so you have uh, seat belts up front. You also have seat belts over there on the dinette and seat belts up front. So you have plenty of places to sit as we put that out of the way here. And as we move on back, 84 inch ceiling height, plenty of headroom in here. And here you are at our kitchen. The kitchen in the Ace, fully equipped and you have solid surface countertops now. That is a great feature. Solid surface countertops, that includes the cover. You do have nice accent lights down below, plenty of storage. You have a three burner gas cooktop. You have the microwave. You have an oven, the nice blue lights on the oven that are a nice night light. If you need a night light, you got one. And that brings me to something else that is different about the 2023 Ace. Because we have changed the front cap and that is no longer there. That gives us room to put a bigger overhead bunk up top. So you have sleeping up front for you know, someone on the dinette that makes into a bed. We have someone on the sofa and there is our overhead bunk, 500 pounds up there. It locks into place. It's controlled with a little switch over by your entry door. Lots of great sleeping up here and lots of storage for whatever you need up here, right? You got all of these great cabinets up here. You have uh, entertainment up here. Now, one thing that we do, we do have we do have your TV here. We have a TV in the bedroom. This Ace also has a TV outside. And we give you an HDMI cable, and there are a lot of great things you can do with that. And we're gonna get we're gonna talk a little bit about getting a uh, setup for your WineGuard Connect 2.0 4G hotspot and Wi-Fi extender because that is going to be very handy if you like to stream or you play online video games, you can do that while you are on the road. Yep, that's your uh, flip out dash workstation. We are going to get a little more into that when we get into our dashboard. But look at that. You got 12 volt uh, plugs up there. You can charge phones and devices. And WineGuard, what's nice about this is this is really Wi Fi or internet anywhere you go. So you got the Wi Fi extender, right? And it's going to increase your Wi Fi range when you're at the campground, which by the way, Wi-Fi is the number one thing people look for when they are looking for a campground. You can FaceTime your friends, you can scroll through social media, and it works with any carrier. All you have to do is get a data plan through either WineGuard or through your favorite carrier. And then up top on the dish itself, all you have to do is insert that SIM card, and now you have Wi-Fi. And I find it interesting with with the wi-fi as i kind of study up and read around you know what people are looking for in campgrounds koa did a, a survey last year and they they asked teenagers they said how many of you could go on a camping trip and get completely disconnected how what percentage do you think said that comment below the answer of all the teens that koa surveyed 71 percent 71% of teens, yeah, I can completely disconnect, but now that people have learned that they can work remotely, what a great tool that is to have. So it is the WineGuard Connect 2.0 4G hotspot and Wi-Fi extender. You are going to love having it. More storage down here below in the kitchen. Nice place to store your, your sink covers. 
You also have a number of drawers here. So you have a silverware and whatever else you need, more cabinet space up here. And as we walk back, there is our fridge. You have a double door fridge. And this particular unit, that is a 12 volt. So remember we talked about turning your battery disconnect switch on. Mm -hmm. You do the math, that's why you want that on. And here we are into the bathroom. Great bathroom set up in here. I really enjoy the way that the curved shower in here is nice. Uh, you have your porcelain toilet. Uh, now remember when you, we showed you the, the macerator out there, make sure you're using marine grade or RV toilet paper, even though you have that handy tool macerator. And again, you don't have to use it every single time you flush the tank, just when you really want uh, the deep clean, if you will, make sure you're using a RV or marine grade toilet paper. And I do want to show you in the shower, new for this year is the shower miser. Because one of the things that happens, right? So you're, you're, you're taking a shower and you turn on the water and you're going like this. Did you know doing this doesn't make the water hotter faster? It doesn't, but the shower miser makes sure you do not waste your fresh water, right? So there's a handle on the shower, little one, you turn that up and you're turning your hot water. And then the hot water is going to get flowing, right? And then as soon as that water is hot, right here, watch what happens. See, it goes from blue, it's magic, turns to white. Now you know that the water is hot. So the little lever you're seeing right over here on the right side of your screen, take and turn that handle down, and that will release all of the hot water for your shower. So it's the shower miser. It is here on the Ace. In fact, you can find out in every Thor motor coach this year. So what a great tool that is. Now, right across from the bathroom we do have our bunks this is the 32b this is the bunkhouse model yeah we got popcorn in here because you know why the kids are staying in there they wanted a movie night on the tablet holders this is their little retreat and if they want to eat popcorn in the bed on their vacation go ahead and let them they're the ones who have to sleep in the kernels right you do have usb charging ports you also have a 110 charging uh plugs as well so whatever you have going on back there or if uh, now when i travel with with my kids in the ace one takes the overhead bunk, the other will either take the dinette or the sofa, and then we use the bunks for just, just storing stuff while we're away. So a lot, of, a lot of great uses there. And that is going to take us into the bedroom. Why don't we head back here? Because this is a, a great bedroom back here. You do have a king size bed. Uh, look at the size of those nightstands. Large nightstands, you can put a tablet up there. You have USB charging ports. You do have a 12 volt plug there. So if you have to have a portable CPAP, you can plug that right in there. And the closet on this 32B is absolutely amazing. You have all kinds of storage over here, right below you have a number of drawers right below there. See, there's a better shot of that 12 volt. And then you can see your USB charging ports. You can go ahead and put whatever you need to in there. And then when we get over to the closet, whoo, look at that. I didn't even have enough stuff to fill that up. Now, the, the paper you're seeing, the sticker there, that's your serial data card. What's really nice about that, it's an easy to remember location. It is the list of all the components in your motorhome. So if you ever need, a, what, what is the serial, what is, what, what is that part? What, what? You're gonna find it right there. You have a TV in the bedroom. You have a lot of drawers. You have a large dresser top. There it is again, look at that. You can even charge a, another device there. So you will never run short of charging devices or charging places to charge your devices in the ACE. And when you're not sleeping, how about we get behind the wheel? I love driving the ACE. I've, again, I've taken it all over. So let's head up front, take a look at our cockpit because we do have to talk about a couple of things here. I'll just, I'll just walk up here. Um, let's talk about, how about we talk about just the amount of storage up here? So you can see down below, you want to put, uh, put your maps, your sunglasses, huge cup holders down here, massive. You can, you can get the, uh, the big, the Ariana, Ariana Grande coffee in, in put down there. So all kinds of stuff you down there, place for your phone, your HVAC controls, you do have traction control on this, and you do have one heck of a radio system on there. This thing has everything on here. You have Sirius XM satellite radio, you have Apple CarPlay, you have Android Auto. So that is going to make sure you have what you need on your trip, right? So if you, uh, it, the messages, uh, now the one thing that we're gonna talk about is navigation here because you may not have an RV specific map loaded. Not a problem because with your ACE, 
you get one year of Rode Pass Pro. Now this is, this is four apps combined into one and you will have access to RV navigation. I mean, this is going to help you plan your trips. It's a great social media network site for uh, people who travel and camp. You also can uh, look up reviews of campgrounds before you go there. Or what did this person say? Oh, they had a clean bathhouse. So now this was eh, a little dicey. So maybe you're going to go somewhere else. Uh, maintenance reminders you're going to have on there. So all kinds of great sources there. That is Road Pass Pro. You get that uh, one year with the purchase of your new Thor Motor Camp. I do want to talk about a couple of the buttons here uh, as I'm going, to, I'm going to stand here and stare at them. Over here on your left side, these are going up at the top, these are going to take and control the little information center. On the inside, you're going to have a, an engine hour meter, your outside air temperature, a couple of trip meters, miles to empty. Um, then down below is your cruise control and the button pad over on your right, I love. This is a new addition and you have your, your phone hooked up here. You do consult, you can select your source. In the middle there's a, a source button and you can go ahead and flip through the sources. We talked about the side view cameras. What's great about this is if you press the little camera button, while you're driving, you can pull up not only your rear camera, but your side view cameras at any point during your trip. And I'm telling you what, that is something you want to have when you are going to make a lane change. Uh, under the hood, if you will, 7.3 liter V8, 350 horsepower, 468 pound-feet of torque, and what do you do when you drive? You put the hammer down. This is connected to a six-speed torque shift, select shift transmission. You do have a tow haul mode on here. We talked about that 8,000 pound hitch. You do have hill start assist. So that is gonna be great if you are towing or even if you're just in town somewhere and they have those slight grades. All you have to do is drive it normally, right? The ACE will do the work for you and it will keep your ACE in place when you let your foot off the brake and move to the accelerator. You're not gonna roll forward or down the hill. So a lot of great features in this ACE. It is just about everything you could ever want in a motor home. And, and as I walk through here, it's really kind of a, it makes me a meander down the streams of, of vacations past, if you will, because I took my first vacation in an ACE with my kids, and that would have been six years ago. And now we're at the point where, you know, my, my oldest is getting ready to, to head off to college. Uh, my younger one starts high school, and, and we know that our time is limited. So you want to get out there and make your memories. And, and maybe you're in the same boat that my wife and I get in. We research everything. We're like, well, maybe maybe we wait here and you know there'll be a better time for this and then we'll wait because there'll be a better time maybe this isn't the perfect time and, and as I think about that there's there's really never going to be a perfect time the time is now to take take your family go out on vacation make those memories and do it in the ace because remember it's not about having time it's about making time I appreciate you being here today If you would like to see sales prices from the only full line and fully authorized Thor Motor Coach dealership in the world, visit Motorhome Specialist at MHSRV.com or call 800-335-6054. Motorhome Specialist is the number one volume selling motorhome dealership in the world. With over $165 million in inventory to choose from, all at one central location making it easy to fly in from anywhere in the country and then drive your new dream motor coach home. You will also enjoy the premier delivery process that can only be found at MHSRV. From the extensive pre-check and make ready process to the only dealership performed and fully automated rain booth test in the industry, you'll see a world of difference at Motorhome Specialist. These additional detail and inspection processes are just a few of the countless steps taken here at Motorhome Specialist to help ensure that you not only receive a better selection and price, but also the unparalleled quality and service that you deserve to go along with it. So get busy living in an all new Thor Motor Coach from Motorhome Specialist today. Why pay more? Why settle for less?